If you've used Ethereum and you've paid gas, then you've got free money waiting for you. LFG less effing gas is a Solana airdrop for Ethereum users off the back of how much gas you've actually paid. In this video, I'm gonna break down the claim, all the information, all that you need to know. Um, also, this is not financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor. Please do your own research before moving in on the space. It can be very risky. And even though this is free money, there are a lot of scams out there. So it is very risky. So the TLDR, LFG less effing gas is a token airdrop for Ethereum users for Solana. And they actually break it down here. Now it is a claim that you can get right now. You don't need to spend any gas to get it because it is virtually, because gas is almost like free on Solana. So they're actually paying for it. So there's no even risk of gas fees when it comes to claiming this. And there is um, sort of liquidity right now. So you can get it, you can actually sell it, you can swap it right now, you can get some cash. Um, I'm gonna break that down. So what I would do is head over to X on the platform and look up for less F and gas. They've got around 16,000 followers now. When you see this, they'll, they'll have more. Um, but be very careful about the account that you're looking for. You can see the handle here, less fn gas the reason i say be careful is that this guy actually lost one hundred twenty-five thousand dollars worth of staked eth because he actually clicked on the wrong link so yes uh, because there's free money involved people are just it's absolutely chaotic out there so how do you claim head to the x account and then click on the website link here don't trust any links that anyone will DM you or anything just like I showed you. What this will then do is take you to their website. When you hit on the website, you can see um, there's nothing much to it. Um, just a postcard from Solana Beach. Uh, up top right, hit claim up here. And then this will then pop up a um, box for you to then select the ETH wallet that you're going to use. Now this will be the ETH wallet that you actually um, have used and spent all the gas on. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to collect connect the ETH wallet. Now after you have connected your MetaMask account, you will need to connect a Phantom wallet. This will be the Solana wallet. Um, I'm going to run through the claim right now. If you don't have a Phantom wallet set up, use the chapters down below and this will get you to um, how to set up a Phantom wallet. Um, but I'm just assuming that you've got a Phantom wallet set up. So then you collect phantom wallet and the same deal you will then hit connect what you then do is you then hit claim lfg um, what this does is it takes a little bit of time um, maybe around sort of uh, less than a minute and then you will have the lfg in your wallet now if you've already made that claim use the chapters down below so you can kind of fast forward to the next section this is how you set up your phantom wallet what you should do is head to x and look for phantom P-H-A-N-T-O-M and then hit phantom.app. What this will do is this will then take you to their website. Once you're on their website, hit download. Now this will then take you to the download section. Um, I'm going to assume that you've got Chrome set up, but if you've got um, other uh, browsers set up, you can then go that. Hit on Chrome. What this will then do, is this will take you to the Google Chrome store, Chrome store, and then you will have to hit download now after you have downloaded you will need to get your recovery phrase um, and set up the wallet you'll set up the password then you'll go through the recovery phrase if you've set up the metamask account which you have done because you're doing the claim you'll know exactly what it is and then you'll have access to your phantom wallet now that you got the lfg in your wallet how do you sell it the easiest way i believe is to go to radium now with radium this is one of the trading platforms you could also use um, jupiter now when you land on radium you're going to hit launch app when you hit launch app i've already got um lfg selected but what you can then do is select a token now if you type in lfg you're then going to get a lot of different variations here now the best way you can um, kind of go about this is head to the lfg x account and then actually copy and paste this address in doing this ensures that you're actually in the um, sort of in the swap that you actually want and you're not in something else. Um, it shouldn't be an issue because you're looking to sell and not looking to buy, but this just helps out. So then head back to Radium, paste in the address and then it should populate here. What this means is it means that you're then going to be selling your LFG. Um, we can go max it out and then you can trade it for whatever you'd like. So you can trade it for Sol and you can see at this current point in time right now, I have 
0.668 Solana, so around $72. Um, this was up a little bit higher earlier. And then all you need to do is hit swap and then it'll go through, it'll pop up in Phantom Wallet saying, would you like to confirm? Um, you can then say yes, no, and then go from there. Now, how can you look at the current price of LFG and what's actually happening? I like to use Dex Tools or Dex Screener. Um, this is Dex Screener. What you can then do is go back to the search. Um, you can then paste in the address and then you'll see LFG. That is the best way to do it because you'll actually find it. If you search for it, you could end up with the wrong one. Now, what you can see here is you can see the total liquidity, the market cap, all of that. The FDV, so the fully diluted um, valuation is 63 million, so 62, 63 million at its current point in time. Um, so that is what we're looking at market cap wise. Now you can see here that it has, from its peak, it's pulled back around 50%. Um, so um, what you can then do is you can have a look at the charts, have a look at the price and the resistances. You can also see all of these sales down below about what's actually happening. Um, I think that this over the next period in time, um, there is going to be downward pressure as people do claim, as people sell, um, all of that. Um, what am I currently doing with this? I'm actually just holding on to it. 70 bucks isn't really life changing for me. So I'm just going to write it out, hold it in case it actually runs up to um, sort of something like a um, 100 million, 200 million, 500 million. I'm not sure what they're going to do. Um, but for me, I'm rather just going to hold on to it. And then when I get a little bit bored with it, I'll then sell it and swap it out for something like Solana to then have a play around with with meme coins. Now, what are the tokenomics? Where could this go a little bit longer term? Well, one of their tweets, um, the one that has the address, explains here that the airdrops account for 60% of it. Early contributors get 10%, liquidity 6%, and the treasury 24%. One of the reasons why I'm going to hold this um, is, first off, it's quite a low amount. But secondly, because it's on Solana, if this can have a bonk effect, which is the people holding this um, token can then get additional tokens and airdrops later. That is the game plan that I have. If this was around sort of four or five hundred dollars worth, I'd sell it instantly and then roll it out. But at the moment, I don't think that it is enough. It's it's a bit of a gamble and a bit of a play just to see how it runs out over the next sort of three or four days. Now here are just some tidbits and bits of information. The claim ends in one month, so the end of January. So if you are gonna do it, go to the end of January. You can kind of, uh, that'd be the last time you can claim this. If you're watching this after um, sort of January 31st, you may have missed out. Now, a lot of prominent people have actually claimed this. So we can see someone like Pranksy has claimed, um, someone like Zeneca has also claimed. So there have been some high profile people that have claimed. So even though you should be doing your own research, a lot of people have claimed it. It does look like it's safe so it shouldn't be too much of an issue but it is capped you can see here that pranksy um, wasted 1.7 million dollars in gas and claimed 13.46 million lfg tokens and me i've got in my wallet um almost 1.2 million tokens and uh, i spent sort of around eight thousand dollars in gas um so it it doesn't it's a capped airdrop it's not um a structured tiered airdrop so um please be aware that if you have spent a lot of money on gas you don't expect something super fat but if you haven't spent um a threshold of around four thousand dollars i think that's where the airdrop kind of starts and kicks in so if you've spent um two three four hundred bucks on gas then don't expect a fat airdrop from this at the moment it's just free liquid it's just easy to get easy to take um and then roll it into solana or roll it into meme coins or whatever free liquids good liquid um yeah that's it so hopefully you enjoyed this breakdown um a bit about um lfg um less f and gas um and then hopefully it can turn into a little bit more cash later other than that free liquids good liquid um hopefully you enjoyed this video if you did leave a juicy comment down below let me know how much gas you spent and what you were able to do with that airdrop i had a pleasure making this video hopefully you enjoyed watching it and i look forward to seeing you in the next video